this video, we will be obtaining the generator matrix for 7, 3 systematic cyclic code. Here n equal to 7 and k equal to 3. Generator polynomial first we have to find. So generator polynomial is a factor of x raised to n plus 1. That is here x raised to 7 plus 1. And it has the degree 7 minus 3. That is n minus k. That is equal to 4. Uh, so we know the factorization of x raised to 7 plus 1. That is x plus 1 x cube plus x square plus 1 x cube plus x plus 1 but we want the degree to be 4 degree is the highest power of the polynomial so here uh, if you multiply this and this then you will get uh, x raised to 4 plus x cube plus x plus x cube plus x square plus 1 this is mod 2 operation so x cube x cube get cancelled out so you will get x raised to 4 plus x square plus x plus 1 and x cube plus x plus 1 so this is the polynomial with highest power 4 that is degree equal to 4 so we can use this as a generator polynomial or if you multiply this and this that means this one and this one then again you will get a um, polynomial with a degree 4 so x raised to 4 plus x square plus x plus x cube plus x plus 1 x x gets cancelled out so you will get x raised to 4 plus x cube plus x square plus 1 and x cube plus x square plus 1 is another factor so this also you can use as a generator polynomial and find the generator matrix but here in this case we are using this one x4 plus x square plus x plus 1 so we know how to uh, obtain the generator matrix this is your generator polynomial x raised to 4 plus x square plus x plus 1 so here uh, what we are doing we are taking highest power here so 1 cube is not there so 0 then x square is there so 1 then x is there 1 x raised to 0 that is equal to 1 that is there so 1 so in generator matrix how many columns are there columns are n 7 we filled 5 columns 1 2 3 4 5 so remaining you insert two zeros so these two zeros so you got uh, get 7 columns how many rows are there to the generator matrix it has k rows that means n columns and k rows k is 3 so we we need another three uh, another two rows so for that we are shifting this towards this side by one by one so if you should uh, shift uh, this uh, to here uh, this position then this zero will come here so one zero triple one zero again shift by one so one zero triple one and these two zeros will appear here so this is the non-systematic form of generator matrix now a systematic form is like i into p that is uh, first you will get identity matrix and then parity but here you should know uh, uh, how many um, rows and columns are there for identity matrix so identity matrix is of uh, dimension k into k k is 3 so we have to make a row operation in such a way that you will get here 3 by 3 identity matrix in front so uh, for getting 3 by 3 identity matrix you have to concentrate here only on these three what columns so you are seeing that uh, uh, r2 and r3 are in the identity form only r1 is not in identity form 101 1. for that what the operation you will do you will uh, if you do r1 plus r3 plus means mod 2 operation then 1 plus 1 will be 0 and you will get 100 0. so r1 is r1 plus r3 now and r2 is as it is and r3 is as it is so if if you uh, do what this one um, uh, r1 and r3 so here how to this uh, do this operation so wherever uh, uh, even ones are there you have to place 0 and odd ones are there you have to place what 1 so 1 0 1 then 0 then 1 plus 1 is even 1 plus 1 means even ones so 0 then 1 1 plus 0 even uh, odd 1 so 1 here 1 1 0 then 1 1 so 1 1 r3 is not get uh, is not going to changed because we are doing the operation uh, we are changing r1 with r1 plus r3 so 
दिस इज मॉड टू ऑपरेशन वन जीरो वन जीरो जीरो देन वन वन इज जीरो देन वन जीरो इज वन देन वन वन इज जीरो जीरो वन इज वन जीरो वन इज वन आफ्टर दैट आर टू इज एज इट इज सो आई रिटर्न आर टू जीरो वन जीरो ट्रिपल वन जीरो देन आर थ्री इज ट्रिपल जीरो वन जीरो ट्रिपल वन सो यू कैन ऑब्जर्व हियर यू गॉट द आइडेंटिटी मैट्रिक्स ऑफ डायमेंशन थ्री बाय थ्री थ्री रोज थ्री कॉलम्स एंड दिस इज पैरिटी मैट्रिक्स सो यू गॉट द जनरेटर मैट्रिक्स इन द सिस्टमैटिक फॉर्म